Lafayette is now 3-0 at this home venue after the opening of Gummison Grounds. 1-0 the score in this Patriot League opener against Holy Cross. Re recap what's happened in this one. The first half saw it tough for the offenses to get a lot going. Mackenzie Wagner patrolling the cage for Holy Cross did not allow a shot to be taken by Lafayette until the final minutes of the first half thanks to some key crucial clears on crosses. Two real good opportunities from Holy Cross successive. The second effort of that was high from Krenna Beckstein. And later in the half, heavy trap by Ava Murphy couldn't lead to a shot. It wasn't until late in the first half that we saw two shots. This was the second one wide from Heather Plowright. In then one final shot by Ashley Blocka. In the second half, this is uh, another half that saw a slow start in terms of the offense, but then a buildup that was nice. Sarah Oswald denied on a beautiful diving stop by Mackenzie Wagner. Get another look at this one. The goal from Nadia Zaffanella, which just hit off the post and in on the header. This was the best chance for Holy Cross after the goal conceded, but a save by Lindsay Dewar. Dewar falling on this corner kick after initially missing. And in the end, a 1-0 clean sheet victory for the Leopards as you see the shot total after giving up the advantage 5-2 in the first half. They had six of the seven shots in the second half. Five shots on goal compared to three. Seven corners compared to three. And as a result, a victory for Lafayette. The individual leaders in this one. Well, obviously, Nadia Zaffanella having the big finish in the game. The goal obviously stands out. Also credit as not pictured Lindsay Dewar with the shutout. Had five saves uh, in the game for the shutout. Meanwhile, Mackenzie Wagner, three saves of her own. That'll do it here from Mike Berger Field at Oak Stadium. The final score, Lafayette 1. Holy Cross Zero. I'm Adam Dubrovsky reminding you that all games airing on the ESPN networks are streaming live and archived on the ESPN app. Men's soccer coming up at 6. Make sure to join us for that. But until next time, this has been a presentation of ESPN. Enjoy the rest of the day, everybody.